Hello Scorpio, welcome back in. Let's see what messages show up for you, Scorpio Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Thank you so much, guys, for staying connected. Okay, we have a flipper. Okay. So I'm back after a very long break. Thank you so much, guys, for staying connected. Month of November is showing up, Scorpio. Okay. Anything else? Scorpio. Just have one more. Okay. Bow. That's interesting. You're highly thought of. That's very interesting. Wow. Let's keep it here. Okay, so we have November. The month of November is showing up here strongly. So very soon. Oh my god. Success. Wow. So from now to month of November. Something important can happen, some important developments can happen in this time period. Elephant, a long journey, either physical or mental, will leave you wiser at the end. So I'm picking up near, starting from now, or maybe the energy is right now going on towards the month of November. So we have August, September, October, and November. We have around three to four months. Um, Scorpio, somebody, and you know, that's your season. <laughs> that's your season coming in so from now onwards i'm picking up whatever journey is starting in your life or whatever has recently started in your life scorpio it's a massive success is heading your way oh my god we have carriage a journey either physical oh my god like this is no coincidence this is no coincidence right similar thing happened uh, while i was reading for libra also uh, they were talking about some plan and literally every card had that message by you know some means and similar is happening here with you too so i do see that whatever journey you are on scorpio you guys are going to find that success very soon right to maybe from now to the month of november i see major massive developments happening and they're talking about some journey too so be be prepared be prepared to travel if you are planning for travel a long-term travel maybe a business travel or for other of you others of you this can be about some mental growth you know some some there's a very clear message that at the end you're going to be much more learned than what you are experiencing today for someone very specific this can be simply a journey for a higher course a higher qualification maybe you're traveling towards some other part of the world or some other part of the country for higher education but for the rest of you this can be, of course this can be a business travel also that's that's on the cards big travel on the cards possibly and for the rest of you this is about this is about uh the upliftment the enlightenment very soon that that's coming in wonderful wonderful energy overall let's see what tara has to say from now to the month of november i'm picking up quite long time period oh beautiful okay this can be the journey of a new relationship that's starting in your life new love situation for a lot of you i'm picking up that a new love situation has started that's showing up in the cards very strongly oh boy okay for someone very specific i just felt scorpio that there can be somebody around you can be an can be an air sign gemini libra aquarius um who's going to put forward a little challenge maybe this person is already there in your surroundings this person can be a family member i'm picking up a family situation also uh, now this is a love situation and a family situation right you can club both of them for a lot of you i see a new love situation that has already started recently or starting very soon in your life and this has something very important to do with uh, your family and a specific family member too right for a lot of you this is some gemini libra aquarius you're dealing with or for the rest of you this is um somebody in your family is putting forward some questions some logic wow for someone i'm also picking up that uh, while you're deciding to take this love situation more seriously uh, turn into a long-term relationship somebody might question your idea about it right wow we have six of swords in the reverse position for a lot of you as you proceed forward in this situation for time being so the, the outcome the final result is showing up in the month of november in this time period you might find the situation getting halted for some time right so you might not be expecting that of course you might feel that okay i'm, I'm you know i'm on this journey 
but for some of you i'm strongly getting this message that uh, in this time period some delay might happen right some forward movement that you were expecting that might get halted for some of you i'm also getting this message that if you're planning to travel that might get delayed but that's going to happen it's on the cards it is going to happen but uh, so if you were planning in the month of august or if you were planning in the month of september it might get delayed for a month or two right wow but see the hope is still there it's overall very positive scorpio three of cups for some of you i felt some reconciliation happening here right before you go somewhere or before this uh, this new journey starts some reconciliation is on the cards right something wow i'm picking up for someone i also felt that somebody's planning a farewell party for you if you're planning to travel right the friends and the family members or if you for someone i also felt a new journey of a relationship marriage or commitment is also starting in your life so people might uh, bring a very joyful energy towards you this can be a party this can be for some of you this can actually actually be a marriage that you're planning wedding planning i'm picking up for some of you for the rest of you this is reconciliation party meeting friends making taking this person to your uh, to meet your family members also i'm getting this message wow very interesting overall what else wow look at that just these two cards flipped over together two of cups and eight of wands an important conversation surrounding love okay so for one thing i'm totally sure here is that this has to do something with your love life right scorpio love situation or your love life we have that big transformation here you are bottom of the deck another thing i'm sure of is that this is going to be a life-changing event for you right this new relationship that is starting in your life or the new relationship that has started this new person who has entered your life this connection this is going to be transformative the person who's entering your life or the person who has just entered your life is going to have a transformative impact on your life and whatever i'm saying you might feel that this person you know ashes jibbering jabbering but whatever this is you're going to see the reward the results on the ground practically by the month of november everything will be clear in the upcoming two or three months literally everything will be clear in front of you I see some important conversation, some body for movement happening in this situation. Let's clarify. Let's get more cards clarified. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Very interesting message till now for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Very interesting message till now, Scorpio. So, what about this new love situation starting? someone i am feeling that the problem or the situation that is getting delayed it is because of this particular uh, person here right for some of you this can be you scorpio putting forward a very clear vocal um, or verbal excuse or verbal i'm not getting that word that argument surrounding how to take this situation forward right i see you're taking practical decisions right or somebody who is in this situation with you is making very practical decisions oh you have been waiting for this opportunity i'm sorry opportunity you have been waiting for this opportunity like forever scorpio and it is here and it is going to be transformative and um, you have no idea how beautiful this is going to be right but why why is this okay for a lot of you you are about to jump into see again this is journey you're getting my point so uh, what i'm feeling is that whosoever the specific person is who's showing up very strongly in your reading this person is not here to stop you per se but they're bringing some information right they're bringing some information yes for a lot of you their intuition might be poking them this can be a mother figure this can be a sister maybe the person you're getting into a relationship with this is an important female figure this can be you also right i see you deciding to take the leap of faith here this is again you know fool is also the card of journey so some important journey some important travel on the cards right what i feel here is that uh, some important information is suddenly coming in queen of cups okay eight of swords and nine of wands now whatever this person is bringing forward you might get triggered at first 
okay the reason frankly the reason i'm getting here that why the situation is getting delayed is that whatever information this person is bringing in it might trigger you at first right uh, so I would say that whatever call or whatever, inf whatever information is coming in, it might trigger you at first. So, but then for a moment, you might even get emotional. Maybe this person is bringing the news that uh, your flight is getting delayed or your uh, the marriage has to be delayed. Something is getting postponed. Some delay is happening here. That's going to make you feel overly emotional. Here you are, Queen of Cups, right? And for a moment, you're going to feel a little blindfolded, confused, directionless even. And your cards are going to be high, right? For some of you, I'm even getting that feeling that, okay, I made it public. I told my friends. I was so hopeful. Now, what 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 will I do, you know? That feeling of little, feeling a little insecure about what will happen because I've made it public already, you know? But don't worry. See, High Priestess in the reverse position. For a lot of you, uh, listen to your intuition. Calm yourself down. You're not connecting to your intuition. You might get a little triggered and you're just reacting very quickly. But trust me, wait for this information to come in, right? Let's see more. What is this? Two of Cups. What is this Two of Cups? Wow. Okay. You're getting the strength. The strength is coming from your relationship. So whatever this person is bringing forward, your partner is standing by you, right? And uh, let's see what is this conversation about. Hanged Man, Six of Pentacles, Five of Swords and Tower. Look at that. Wow. Oh my God. Okay. Some planning will be required at the end right you might even feel that some people are plotting against you in this situation there there is gossip there's trickery at the end but no trust me the sun is at the bottom of the deck it's eventually going to be in your favor it's eventually going to be it's like i guarantee you the success right that was the first card that came out so i i am i'm guaranteeing you that towards the end you are going to be successful but the problem is the problem is that some information that's coming your way, it might trigger you at first, right? So be patient, listen to your intuition before you deal with the situation, be very calm. Because, again, your partner, I feel, is going to be very supportive, but there is some manipulations and plot, plot, uh, plotting going on behind the scenes, right? For a lot of you, I'm also feeling that whatever experience you're going to have in this situation, even if it is not a physical travel, right? Even if it is a new journey that's starting in your life, this phase is going to be a little challenging because I'm picking up power, hanged man. Look at that in enlightenment happening. Now, this is again uh, pointing towards the wiser outcome. You're getting my point. Whatever trickery is happening, whatever challenge is coming your way, it's going to be a little... Um, unexpected surprising right but towards the end I'm, I'm seriously picking up that towards the end it's going to be that success oh my god look at the judgment look at these two cards so it's going to work out in your favor scorpio all you have to be careful is that you have to just go through this journey these one or two months whatever this is journey this mental journey or whatever it is you have to be calm in this whole situation you have to listen to your intuition because at the end see you're highly thought of for a moment i'm also also getting another message here scorpio that for a moment i'm sorry for a moment it can come to your mind that people are judging me People are, people are having wrong judgments about me or people are plotting against me. You might end up having some negative thoughts, but you have to be, you know, you have to be very strong and you have to just shed off those thoughts. You have to quickly shed off those thoughts because, oh my God, I'm thinking a very beautiful outcome here for you, honestly. Very beautiful outcome for you. <clears throat> let's, let's have a card of advice for you, Scorpio. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Let's see where is the situation heading. Scorpio. Reverse the rules if needed. Switch the cases. You know, you don't have to force the reading on your situation. Sometimes the journeys are tough. The means are tough. But the, you know, I'm sorry, the ways are tough. But the final outcome is beautiful. Right? Oh my God, look at that. Between the worlds. And isn't it confirming this death card is confirming the same thing? There's a confirmation here. Isn't it? 
between the worlds and why for a lot of you again this phase is going to churn you a little bit there's some and you know uh, enlightenment spiritual enlightenment spiritual upliftment is never a cakewalk you're going to have a lot of questions in your mind why me why this happened why this phase why things are getting delayed why i'm it just trust and have faith in the divine timing scorpio it's working out for you it's really working out for you you just have to calm yourself down right whoa scorpio what else messages for scorpio it's time to release negativity and possibly the delay that's happening here is because you really need to calm yourself and let go of some things let go of some past experiences right the big opportunity that is coming to you is going to be life-changing right over these three months your life is going to change but before it happens you will have to and look at that full moon in scorpio you have an idea about uh, the debilitation of moon in scorpio we are overly sensitive people those who are having moon in scorpio in their chart we are overly sensitive people right because moon tends to get debilitated in scorpio right so sometimes see meditate and contemplate listen to your intuition so you guys will have to calm yourself down here let's see one more step out of your comfort zone again i'm getting this strong message have faith in your dreams whatever you're planning whatever end you're planning is going to working out exactly the way you want you're manifesting it but trust me you will have to step out of your comfort zone you will have to release some things you will have to experience a little i won't say difficult but little challenging situation at first because only then you are being prepared for some beautiful massive success at the end right oh my god oh my god i was planning for a week's reading but whatever i am getting here it's not it cannot be summarized in a week it's gonna happen over two three months right and it has already started for a lot of you from past one month you're already experiencing this or maybe a few weeks but you're in that journey already and it is going to give you the final outcome i would say the climax that you're going to experience is in the month of november so i'm gonna leave you here guys thank you so much for watching oh my god bye bye <laughs>